Good afternoon guys, welcome to Rex Group. This is an amazing motor car. I've worked really hard to buy this. This is a July 2014, first of the new model, 14 registered, uh, BMW 40D SE, but without question M, uh, M Sport spec. Done 58,000 miles, seven seat variant guys. Repeat, seven seat variant. Only 10% of the production run was with those valuable seven seats. This car's got them, okay? Um, three owners in total, full, full service history four or five visits with uh, BMW. Drop links have been done on the front. It's had a new air suspension pump recently. What's needed spending has been spent. It's been, uh, it's had a charmed life, not a hard life. And it's mega, mega spec. Let me just run through the spec with you. Bear with us for a second. So we've got park assistant. We've got surround view camera, front and rear camera packs, 20 inch M Sport uh, alloys, which has just been refurbished in dark shadow chrome, power folding mirrors, high gloss shadow line. It's got a pure, experience design package which looks stunning on it high gloss roof rails privacy pack comfort seats with four-way lumbar and uh, driver and passenger seat memory american oak high gloss interior trim pack that valuable third row seating seven seater option um, sports multifunction steering wheel and sports auto transmission so a massive spec low mileage viewless friendly seven c first of the new model 40d sex 5s here this is not going to be with us very long purpose of the video is to go around the car in detail tell you a little bit more about it and I'll just go so coming onto the front bumper apron front and rear uh park sensing led daytime running lights xenon's camera pack 360 uh bird's eye view pack and the design pack as well uh, on this age relating number, I've been on private numbers, but we're just back onto this number now. We've got a V5 for it, we've got two keys. Guys, 10 years old, 58,000 mi uh, 58, miles. It's not new car money anymore, so expect used car stone chip blemishes, yeah? But in the round, presents really, really well. I think you'd have to look at the five to find better ones. Obviously, got like some sort of black sport pack on it. I think it's part of the pure experience pack. Up onto the bonnet. It's the proper black as well, the black sapphire, not the carbon black, which is the blue black. Correct BMW windscreen, connected drive car. Power folding mirrors and those running balls, which are part of that pure experience design pack, I think. But what a good looking X5. 313 brake horsepower, twin turbo, three litre diesel, U-less friendly engine. Up onto the front wing on the passenger side, that looks to be generally clean and tidy. All the alloys have been recently refurbished in this shadow chrome of the car shod with a matching set of the correct Dunlop Supersport tyres, all at about five to six mil. Okay, read the reviews on these guys. I've had several X5s, I've got three children, they're not kids anymore, they're grown up, but I've had about five or six of them, probably done 60, 70,000 mile in X5 products, and I can report that they are bulletproof. They're a really good car. Um, so, you know, I work hard to try and buy seven seat X5s. It's not an easy job, but when one comes along, we don't look at it for more than a couple of weeks, fact. Up onto the front wing on the driver's side, that's all clean and tidy. That alloy's been refurbished in dark shadow chrome. That's done up Sportmax tire at about five, six mil. Two keys, power folding mirrors work correctly. High shadow line gloss pack, so all the run rails are in black. Factory privacy, driver's door, rear quarter, Rear door, all clean and tidy. That alloy is as new. That tire, Dunlop Sport Max at about seven mil. Inside, got that American Oak trim pack. Correct BMW rubber over carpets. We've got a parcel shelf for it. Power tailgate, seven seats, guys. That's why we're all here, right? Comfort seats. It's an SE, it's SE build, but it's M Sport spec in my opinion. We've got all the history there for it. Just a nice place to be. A little bit old, it's been trading since 2001, over 20 years old now. Based in a little village called East Farley, just outside Maystone in Kent. Read my reviews at Auto Trade. I'm well regarded, been in the industry 35 years. I've owned Oakwoods for 20 of those 35 years. 430 plus five star reviews, built over a seven year period. Go to confirm high levels of customer satisfaction here. I look after my customers, guys, okay? But back to this lovely X540D SC seven seater. Around to the back of the car. Rear parking ape, sorry, rear parking camera, rear park sensing, tow bar, really little used guys, yeah. We've not cleaned it up, that's how it came to us, but just in spectacular condition. Not what you'd usually expect for a family seven seater. Not been chewed around, you've got a parcel shelf there. 
part of the finance with Close Brothers, guys. So before you organise your money for this lovely 7CX5, speak to me or I'll run a rate for risk programme with Close Brothers. Carl leaves me with a three month dealer guarantee and a 14 day money back programme to match the online providers. T's and C's are attached to those products. I'll talk to, them, talk to you about them if you want to buy the car. And I will be prioritising people with retailable part exchanges. So if you're financing with me or you're selling me your old car, that's got a retail opportunity for me, you will go to the uh, front of the queue for this particular motor car. Yeah, cash buyers are at the bottom of that queue. Down the passenger side, that's all clean and tidy. That alloy's been refurbished as new. That's the last of the Dunlop Sportmax tyres, recently new at seven mil. Car's spectacular. No bad odours in here, guys. Not been a smoker's mobile. Just a really nice place to be. So comfort seat pack, super rare on X5, all the handbooks, two keys, comfort seat. There's the provenance check, guys. Tells you what it is. Tells you that it's, um, we think it's two owners, um, but it's three registered keepers. No outstanding consumer finance, no accident history. We've got all the MOT records. It's MOT'd round till December 2023. It was last serviced in November 2022. We're going to do a basic PDI to it and check it over. Um, but here's some invoices there. I'll put it on the advert, but it's had some suspension front arms done in May 2023. It had the EGR cooler recall done in February 2023. That was the last major service, which wasn't cheap. It's had an air suspension pump, which wasn't cheap. That was in July, 2022. That's when the wheels were refurbed. Drop links. So, you know, the car's got a proper, proper history, guys. Load of BMW, specialist cars from Lutes in here. But it'll be all on the advert for you, but it's a proper service history motor car. I've driven the car. I mean, they just drive timelessly, these things. It doesn't feel 10 years old, that's for sure. Power folding mirrors. Seat bolster for a 10 year old motor car, very acceptable. All the camera pack works, guys. Top view, big screen nav. Air conditioning, heated seats. Let's go to the menu. So I think the, own, the next time you're going to be in a workshop is for front and rear brake pads in four and a half thousand miles. go brake fluids fine engine oils recent vehicle checks done and then we've got service history there which i think it's got five entries in total so that was the last service which you saw the receipt for it's a proper service history motor car so there we go guys never many seven seat rex fives for sale i get price is important but you kind of need to throw the book away a little bit um just as important as what you buy and i don't think you'll find a better seven seater than this is up £25,000 and where you buy it from I'm a well regarded independent specialist. So thanks for taking the time to look at the video. My name's Nigel, the company's Opens Group. I'm based in East Valley, just outside Maystone in Kent. You're going to need to be quick guys because this is not going to be with me more than two weeks this Friday. Thanks for watching.